Hi, I'm Kay Detter of Huntsville Green TV. We're here to help you go green without losing your zen. Today's podcast is to show you a couple little gadgets. What I have here is the Instant Off Water Saver. What you do is you replace this aerator with the aerator on your bathroom sink. And for those of us who like to run the water constantly while we're brushing our teeth, you can keep the water on and you actually have to physically touch the bar for the water to flow. So hopefully the best of both worlds. What we're going to do today is we're going to go see how easy it is to install and if it really works. We have the same type of item for the kitchen sink. It replaces your aerator and you have to actually touch the bar for the water to flow. We'll go see how easy this is and if this one actually works. And then if we're successful with that, we'll go on and we'll try the Roadrunner shower head. This is the 1.59 gallon per minute shower head. It has the water restrictor so that you get the, the spray that you want, the pressure that you want, without wasting precious gallons of clean potable water. This little item has what they call a trickle set. If you have, like I do, your water heater in the garage and my master bath is at the far end of the house, it takes a long time for the hot water to come to the shower. What this little gadget does is it senses the water when it goes from cold to warm and it'll drop it from a full flow down to a trickle while you finish getting ready so that you're not wasting precious hot water. Saving hot water not only saves the water, but it also saves your utility bill. We'll go see how easy this is to install and if it really works. Let's go ahead and go to the other room. Come on and join me. Here we are in the kitchen. First thing I have to do is remove the original aerator. Just take my pliers, turn it a couple turns, not too bad. Out with the old, and then we nice included the washer here. So I'm going to simply install the new aerator in place of the old. Okay, here, got it tightened up. Now we're gonna run a test, pull the water. Oh, just a little spray, and press the lever. Sure enough. So now, when I'm peeling potatoes, I can peel the potato, rinse it off, and leave the water going without wasting the water and without doing on and off a zillion times. I cut all my own vegetables, so that might actually be handy. We'll use it for a week and see. If you're interested, there'll be a link in the article below. Here we go. We're going to try to install the Instant Off Water Saver onto the bathroom sink because I like to run the water while I'm brushing my teeth. What we have to do first is remove the original aerator. There we go. Oh, it didn't even have a screen. And we're going to take out our new Instant Off aerator. with the water restrictor and the instant off valve. Just screw it in place with the old one. Little tight. Let's test. Oh, waterfall blast and on water. Off water. All right, that's good work. Okay, here we are in the shower trying to replace with the low flow Roadrunner shower head. I'm going to remove the original shower head. There we go. Get two hands on it. Of 
course, I should have told you before you started that you will need plumber's tape. If you want a nice seal and you don't want chronic leaks, you'll want that. It's inexpensive. You can get it at any drugstore. Here we have our plumber's tape. We're going to wrap just a couple wraps of this filmy little white tape that just does wonders for protecting the connections. Push your fingers over it a little and it kind of gives in the threads that can make it easier to put on. Here we have our Roadrunner shower head that promises to save me lots of water as it's heating up in the morning. This little cord apparently is part of the mechanism. Once it slows, it senses warm water, it slows down to a trickle, it'll stay at a trickle until you either press the lever up here or pull the little cord and then it'll go back to full force again when you're actually in the shower. Cool, it's supposed to save over 7,000 gallons of water a year and $82 off your utility bill. A little $40 Roadrunner, 1.59 gallon per minute trickle. Here we are with the test. See how long it takes to get warm water from the garage is the master bath. Dun, 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 here, let me show you how far that water has to come. And it slows to a trickle. <laughs> it really did. I heard that little bit of sound. And then, once you're through brushing your teeth and you're ready to actually get into your shower, all you have to do is pull on your little tray, and you're back to a full spray. No more wasted water for this kid. All right, that one actually passes the test. Well, we installed two aerators and a low flow shower head. That went pretty well all in all. Now I should be able to save over 7,000 gallons of water a year on my shower. $82 on my utility bill by not wasting that hot water. And now I can brush my teeth with the water running without the guilt because I have the instant off faucet. I'll continue to report to you how successful these things are as I use them. And thank you for joining me today. This is Kay Detter at Huntsville Green TV, where we want to help you go green without losing your zen.